Greetings, greeting. This is Mark Brown. We're going to be looking at Microsoft Word and some of the stuff that we can actually do in Microsoft Word. So I'll be guiding you through this particular area, step by step. All right? So let us dive in. The first thing that we want to look at right here is how to open a blank Microsoft Word document and see how to save it, how to type data in the document, how to change the font size, how to drop cap first letter in the document, insert a paragraph border to the document, add a page border to the document. So these are what we're gonna actually be doing. So very important here. So the first thing that we wanted to do bring up a Microsoft Word document, you're gonna click in the taskbar here and bring up a Microsoft Word. Here we're gonna select, right, blank document right here. So we're gonna extend it just like that. So this is how we actually open the Microsoft Word document. All right, so the next thing that we wanted to do is how to save it. All right, so very important. Now, in order for me to save it, I can come right here to file and bring up this blue screen right here. You're going to click on save as. I can either click here on the desktop or click right here on browse. And I'll take it directly to the desktop right here. So I'm going to click right here and ensure that it's save on desktop. All right, so I'm going to click right here and I'm going to type my work here with it. Then I'm going to come all the way here and set save right here. All right, so very, very important that you come right this and save. All right, so the next thing you wanted to look at is how to type data in it. All right, very important. So I'm going to use a code to type some data in it. So I'm going to say equal R A N D. Then I'm going to put a bracket. So I'm just going to put six, another bracket, and just press enter. And this, this is all actually into some data. Otherwise, you can actually type like that, data inside of it. All right, so very important. So what I wanted to do, how to change the font size. All right, so we're going to look at that. So in order for us to see the font size, all right, you can actually block it like that. And when you block it, you can come right just at home. You notice here, when you click on the little pointer right here, size 11, you can come right here, you notice the font size, click on increasing or decreasing. All right, if you come out here, you notice this big A right here. When you click, you notice increase the font size. You click on one next door, you notice it, decrease it. All right, so now we know exactly how that works. Look at the next instruction. It's a job cap, how to job cap letters in the document. All right, so we're going to be looking at some job cap right here. So the first thing we wanted to do, black first letter, which is a V. And then when you do that, now we want to come to insert and then come all the way on the text. And this is a good job when you click. Come right here, so find a big one, you notice. That is for your job cap. All right, we're going to try the next, next one. We're going to do this repeat, same thing here. All right, we're going to do it for the next one. Just like that. And there you go, we're going to do it for this one. And then we're going to do the same one. This is all your job cap. All right, so very important. Sometimes I go some, some places and look in the book and see all of these. This is all the actually job cap. All right. And this one also insert a paragraph border to the document. All right, so bear in mind that a paragraph border is different from page border. All right, so I'm going to block this whole entire paragraph here. I want to soon another block it, I click on the word home. Top. We're going to come right here. That is a paragraph. I'm a paragraph border. We're going to click right here. Notice you can come right there. So I put all border or I can say outside border. When you click it, there you go. So this is a, is a paragraph border. All right. So the next thing that I wanted to look at now is to add a page border to the document. All right. So page border now. Now we want to come here at design. And when you click on design, you're going to come all the way here. So page border. You notice this is set with the display screen. So if I click one of these, you notice this is what come up and show on this before showing the document. And if I want pretty body, I can come right to add and click. And I can click, you notice the display. But if I don't want it, I can come here. I can actually scroll on like that to choose some border. You notice, and if I click that one, you notice so that I can come right here to change this font size of it. By clicking it, decrease it, or increase it just like that. And then when I finish, I press OK. And this is exactly how you actually do it. So I hope you have learned something from this short video here. So remember to share it to your friend.
and out of that. Very important.